Good morning. I'm Al Pearson, and this is Tree Talk from Pearson Farm. Um, out here in the orchard, the peaches have bloomed, the petals have fallen off, and now the little peaches are growing, and here's some of them right here. There's a, a whole wad of peaches there, and then there's two nicer ones over on this limb. And um, we come through here in about 10 days, and we'll try to select the best peaches, maybe the largest ones on the limb, and we'll pull these little small ones off and put them on the ground. Um, this tree might have 2,000, 3,000 peaches on it, and we don't need but four or 500. So we select the peaches that are in the proper location and that, that look the best. Well, you might already have some that have, um, have some bug damage or maybe some wind damage. You try to pull those peaches off and, and uh, put them on the ground and let the ones that stay here, you let them grow. Um, these larger peaches, they're about as big as the end of my mm, ring finger. And um, that they are growing really nicely. But I don't need but two peaches on this limb, on this tree, to make a crop of fruit and size properly, not be a little small peach that um, is not what we're trying to grow. It'll be a large peach. And, and when it's out in the open like this, it gets sunlight, which is good. It gets air circulation. It'll dry off after a rain. It's already got fuzz on it, which is a protectant for peaches. And, uh, but, and it's also easier to see when you come to pick it. So we like peaches that like peaches to have a little space, but got a lot of work to do. Taking a wad of peaches down to two, and we only do it by hand, got a lot of work to do. So looking forward to it. This is a, it's going to be a good peach year. Come see us.